Next generation of marketing is here. Introducing Gentry 21st Century Systems, a technology-driven, client-focused manufacturer of robotic systems. Gentry Robotics are positioned to be the true catalyst of the next generation of marketing concepts. Gentry has focused on providing the technology and supporting systems for an innovative method of grass bending. That's right, grass bending. If we take a single blade of grass and bend it, light will reflect differently than when standing upright. If we bend thousands of blades of grass sequentially, a pattern appears. Patterns like you've seen before on baseball fields and at other sporting events. Talking about innovative marketing developments, and here we have a sort of a marriage of technology and media. Uh, by combining robotic technology with um, the uh, opportunities to communicate about a product or about a brand, uh, we have uh, essentially an opportunity to revolutionize, which may be too strong of a word, uh, but revolutionize or create kind of a big bang with tremendous opportunities to take this not just uh, into Major League Baseball or Minor League Baseball, but into any venue that involves turf grass. Any major event involving turf grass, whether it's NASCAR, or Major or Minor League Soccer, or uh, um, just anything, uh, golf, uh, any opportunity that involves turf grass, we have an avenue to uh, put our product out there and generate revenues for the sponsor, generate revenues for the company. Now, for the first time, Gentry has come up with a revolutionary computer-guided grass bending device. Seen here are CEO Ron Trissel and Carl Goodmanson of Gentry Systems. This animated proposed full-size model will be equipped with pressure-sensitive pneumatic robotic-controlled rollers and brushes and will be pre-programmed by scanning in logos or artwork into its computerized brain box and all will be guided by a special precision-guided navigation system. Brand name logos and designs of all shapes and sizes will be completed in minutes rather than days, and will be done effectively and efficiently wherever there is grass. Now, here's what a few qualified people have to say about this concept. Gentry 21st Century has got a piece of equipment that will allow a robot to go on our field and not only do that job of bending grass to put that logo that will sell to the market, it will do it with a minimum of manpower, it will do it better than man can do it, it appears, and it's something that will, will be the whole new generation. It's an exciting product. We think that it's gonna be a very successful product and that it's gonna make us a better, more competitive facility here in Lakeland, Florida. In order to do it the right way, the new way, we'll be able to have that done in front of the crowd as the piece of equipment actually entertains them while the rest of the infield is be being gotten ready so that the bounces and the hops are good on the infield. I think it's a product you got to really look at and we're excited about. The potential for something like this, of course, is the potential for an income stream or a profit center. As you know, I've had experience owning ball clubs, and right now I own an independent club in the Northwoods League. My club is in Thunder Bay, Ontario, so the grass conditions there are a little bit different than the grass conditions from the average ball club that you'll have an experience with. But I see this product as not only suitable for baseball, but suitable for virtually any natural grass field condition, whether it be soccer, baseball, football, circus, uh, schools, I, I don't know that there's a limitation if you have natural grass conditions. This is a new medium, but on one time, one occasion, so is the blimp, and so are airplanes which fly over towing banners or the airplanes which are lighted at night and have signage on the underside. I mean, you look out here in back of me, here we are in Lakeland, Florida, Detroit Tigers spring training, a wonderful diamond. You see the historic concept of selling and promoting with the fence sign. Well, the blimp is not a fence sign, it's active. These items are passive. And what you're introducing here is another option in advertising and promotion, which is also active. 
So I compliment you for your process and wish you very good luck with it. Gentry. Tomorrow's technology today.